If you are asking yourself a question, which programming language should I start with? This is probably a wrong question you are asking from yourself. Rather, you should ask, which problem I am interested to solve in future? Once, you get the answer of this question, you might realize you even do not need a programming language at all. All you need is, strong command on some tools and skills and you are good to go in cooperate world. Well, for this video. Let's assume, you need a programming language to solve a problem you are interested in. For example, web designing. Or software development. Now all you need to do is find programming language under your niche of work and start learning that. Programming languages are chosen on basis of two criterias. How much they make your work easy, and how much it is demanded. For example, you want to do web designing, you could learn HTML and CSS. Or, you can learn Python for web development, but for web designing, HTML and CSS are more easy and in demand. Python is rather difficult for web designing, if we compare them with HTML and CSS. Now here comes another question. Which programming language should we choose to learn only for logic building and basic programming syntax and structure? If you ask others, they might say Python because it's easy and in demand. But I would differ, because Python is too easy that if you learn that as a beginner, you will find immense difficulty to learn other languages with much complicated syntax like Java or C++. So in my opinion, every beginner should begin with learning C++ as start because it is not as easy as Python with almost no syntax, or as difficult as Java with complex syntax. So, I hope you got the idea of how you need to think as beginner to programming languages. In upcoming videos, we will learn C++ coding from beginning to advance. Thanks for watching.